Pocket of Americas here in Austin, Texas. Welcome to Austin, Texas for the United States Grand Prix. With lots of overtaking opportunities, this track is quickly becoming a firm fan favorite. As the clock ticks down to lights out, let's join the teams down on the grid. We have 10 turns to the left and 10 to the right here at the fantastic Circuit of the Americas. Overtaking opportunities into turn 1 and 12 at this anti-clockwise 3.6 mile track. And we should see average lap speeds of around 126 miles per hour. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today, it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? There are three main things to worry about there, Crofty. Positioning, awareness, and discipline. First, you have to put your car in a bit of space and make sure you have room to react to what the others are doing. Then you have to watch your mirrors and listen to the sounds around you to get a sense of where everyone is. And finally, just don't get too greedy. Just because a gap exists doesn't always mean you should go for it. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. An immense lap from Lewis Hamilton yesterday puts him on pole position, edging out Sergio Perez, who lines up P2. As we continue... Okay. Just gonna start the race. Punching Jews here. Whoop. Uh, camera. I. Uh, corner cutting. <laughs> with the front wing you've taken some minor damage a new strategy is available on the MFD Back. Okay, take it easy on the car. We can't sustain this level of damage. of an impact let me know you're okay <laughs> a bad block <laughs> uh we'll replay it why not right i'm not at that like you said we're just re just playing around right now
Okay. Tune, what's up, dude? Doing pretty good, man. The underbody's taken some damage. You may start to notice it. the top three spots there. It's all good though. Max versus Pep and with a great lap. I hit the wall. On PS4, I get the PS5 version. Yeah, I got the PS5 version. I'm just playing around. I haven't played a Formula One game in the years. Okay, here we go. I know. I'm just trying to get like reused to it. Like, and then game share. Uh. I don't think I can game share it to you on um, PS5 version on 4, bro, to be honest with you. I just have, I would have to re download it on the 4.
Oh no, go away. I will probably have to do it after after a while. Left wing. Damage. Recommend you box for a new one. Check your MFD for a new strategy option. I don't like that max that you just throw into the corner. Sloppy. Alright, yeah, okay? <laughs> just playing That's around right one. now. Okay, and on uh, the floor, like I said, I'll probably try to do it after after a while, but right now I can't. Uh, Arctic, yeah. I'm just trying to figure out. Perez on the outside. Follow me? That thanks dude. It's going pretty good. Just racing here in uh Second America's here in Austin, Texas. Appreciate the follow, Arctic. Appreciate it very much. I go really wide. Sergio Perez with the fastest lap of the day so far. DRS is now available. 
Oh no. I was doing so good there for two laps. <laughs> wow, I just... One mistake cost me all that track position. for the lead. Reverse stepping, going for the lead. Wow, I'm just all over the place. Maybe that wing damage hurting a little bit? Probably is. I just want to finish the race. You have front wing damage, but only a few laps left. If you can live with it, stay out. Last lap of the race. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. Oh my goodness, I cannot get off that corner for the life of me. Wing is literally damaged. is over Perez is your winner caution flag is out we're gonna finish the race okay pick up rubber and bring it home not the way I wanted to win, uh, finish but drivers of the day Carlos Sinez Good run for him. They take the checkered flag here in Austin. 
after what has been another fabulous Grand Prix. Anthony Davidson, a resounding victory today. What set them apart from the rest? Well, they certainly stood out as a driver with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts Talk about a rough race. <laughs> Finish third still, but man. The drivers are en route to the podium as we speak. What a fantastic win for the Red Bull team. They performed exceptionally today, keeping us firmly on the edge of our seats throughout the entirety of the race. Congratulations to every one of the team. A sloppy race, but I mean. Top three finish, I'll take a top three. I mean, fought all of our way to get up there, stay up there, and. It was not easy. I didn't like that at all, unfortunately. Just beating and banging, but I mean. Some amazing talent out on the track today. But Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? Carlos Sainz would be my first choice for this race. He had excellent race stamina, giving him the opportunity to charge through the ranks. Well, Ants, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one.